previously on. Fuck you! Alright, good, it's dead. Hell Time yeah. To fight fire with fire. Get it to it! Yeah! You gotta be fucking kidding me. Captain, I've confirmed the death of Ethan Winters. What the fuck? To retrieve the body, but I've recorded evidence. Share your screen, and I'll go over the situation. My team and I were careless. Yesterday, we took down the transformed Miranda, but we didn't kill her. Who knew she could fake being a corpse? <laughs> Since Miranda could have infected Ethan, I forcefully took him and Rose with us. But the vehicle they were riding in was attacked. Because Miranda was there, that's when why. When I got to the wreck, Ethan and Rose were gone. The last time I was able to contact Ethan, I heard Miranda's voice. She murdered him. Cold blood. And she is not gonna get away with it. God damn it, when does it end? That's a good question, What's Chris. That, the mission? Just in general, bro. All of it. Three years trying to put this thing in the ground. Three years too long. Can't believe he even died, bro. So wait, do I play as Chris now? So BSAA got here already. They didn't waste any time. Mission adjustment? No, doesn't change anything. Terminate Miranda and rescue Rose. That's the mission. And failure's not an option. Let's have some fun, people. Like old times. Move out. Roger. Okay. K9, I want to know what the hell BSAA is doing here. Find out what you can. Roger that. I'm on it. Been a while since we fought together, Captain. When was the last? The desert? Doing nothing but recon's gotten me out of shape. But thanks to your recon, we know Miranda's plan. Couldn't quite believe it when I heard she turn herself into Mia, though. Taking five shots to the head's nothing to sneeze at, either. Spooky. There goes all the village. And that's Miranda's bitch ass over there. Hey, Alpha. Look at this. What is it? Hmm. Yes, hey, hey. They've gone too far. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Christ. They're Looks gonna crash. Boom. How are you planning on reaching the objective? First, we're gonna have to take that thing out. I've got your back, boss. Let's get to work. Everyone watch for hostile bioweapons. Roger. All right, let's go. Make contact with a group of hostile bioweapons. Oh, shit. There's more than we Watch out. This is for you, Ethan. Rest in peace, buddy. I'm gonna avenge your- I'm gonna avenge your death, buddy. Fuck out of here. Let's go. Western rat is clear, moving out. Roger that. Where was this weapon? Like, I would have loved to have this, that's for sure. BSAA craft spotted. Two guards. <laughs> I can take them. Don't get caught. All right, let's go. It's time to end this shit. What the hell is that thing? It's all new to my seat. That's oh, fuck. Horrendous. Let's go. Oh, shit. I'm walking through hell. But I'm gonna finish. Mark, you can't ooh, 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 ooh. Hell no, hell no. Hell no. Fuck out of here. Come on. Whew. 
That shit was crazy. That's for sure. I feel like I'm in a Call of Duty type of mission. Roger. Tundra here. Leaving some supplies in one of the houses, Captain. Help yourself. That's an understatement, because I know I'm gonna need a lot more than that. Let's do this. Damn, 703 bullets? Z oh, fuck me. Okay, whatever. I don't need to go over there anyways, ho. Okay, right here. Yeah, bitches! That's what I thought. Who else is coming? Umberize, I need some backup. 200 to the fucking- Woo! Shit. Damn. Damn, he bit me. Am I gonna die, bro? Oh, right in the head. Yes. Do I have any stuff? Oh. Uh-huh. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Alright. Let's do this. I've never heard of a mutant my sea colony growing so huge. Come on, bitch. Come on. Come on. Nice. Who else is coming, hmm? Who else? Oh, fuck me. I got bit again. Stupid asshole. I like how the thing disappeared right inside the wall, too. That's cute. This is really intense. Like, this is really intense. Oh, great, I got reload. Come on. All right, not bad. Almost there. I've reached the target location. Damn, this is big. All right, Lobo, marking the target. Roger that, boss. Where? Right here. Okay, bet. Bingo. All right. This is like Rainbow Six Siege, Call of Duty, Battlefield, all in one. You can't be fucking kidding me. Where am I gonna at? No, 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 no. This is not. Sorry. This is not what I want. Great. Reload, please, Chris. Thank you. Chris, thank you. This is not what I want. Okay, Captain. I reloaded. Where do we do? Yeah, hold on. I'm a little bit busy right now, you know? Oh fuck, I'm gonna get hit, aren't I? Shit. Shit, shit! Oh my god, I didn't reload fast enough, this fucking game! Now I gotta reload again! This is so nauseating, bro, come on! Fuck me! Okay, let's go, let's go, come on, come on, come on. Takes a minute to target the point. Try and keep the laser on it as long as you can. I know they're here. Ah, looks like it's about to collapse. Hold your horses. I'm reloading. Oh, come on. You gotta be kidding me. A whole bunch of these shits? For real? Come on. Come on. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I'm fucked, am I? Well, at least they're nice enough for me to wait. I'm fucked. Oh my god, bro. Can I reload, please? Thank you. I hate this fucking game. Alright, let me reload and... Bye! There you go, there you go. Cool, next. Come on, come on. Oh, come on! You gotta be fucking kidding me. You know what? Fuck you. Let's go. 
Let's go. Y'all pissing me off. Y'all pissing me the fuck off. Anyways. Come on. Come on. Thank you. <laughs> Take that. Good. Mega my seat must be below. Finally, what the fuck? Oh lord. Alright. I found what? a way down. I'm going in, the rest of you stay back. What the fuck? Captain, I compared the mold in the village with a sample from the bakers and uh, there's no sign of the genome editing we saw in the E series. The stuff originated here. Huh, okay. Good to know. Thank you. First of all, how am I not dead? Can I craft? I can't even I can't even craft anything. Okay. What the fuck is this? Oh, oh it's Daphne. Huh? Fucking asshole. Oh, damn. I'm getting my ass handed. There's okay. an opening in the roof. You okay. Come on. This is stupid. I literally have one left. Okay, can you use it? There you go. There you go. I can't even use it. And I'm about to get fucked. Yay! I'm getting fucked. That's cool. This is stupid as fuck. How am I supposed to do this? Alright. Let's go. Great. I'm gonna attack from the back, cause... Good! I'll signal with the locator! Alright, bitch. Let's go. Come on! Do something! Come on! Boom. I'm happy. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be fucking kidding me. Alright. The rest of you stay above ground. Alright, so where do I go from here? Oh. Is there an entrance here? Like, where do I go? Oh, right here. Nice. This is really nice. So oh. if Miranda was the fake Mia, where's the real one? That's what I'm saying. Saw any further use for her. I don't get any of this. How did Miranda even know Rose exists? A moldy little bird told her, maybe? We can figure that out later. Focus on the plan. Yeah, bitches. Ew, what is that? I found it. It's the Megamycete. That shit looks like a fetus. So, oh, I can't even use it. Okay. Chris, what do we do? Alpha the squad. I've located the Megamycete. So now we can end this mess after all. Yep. About damn time. And two explosives armed. There's enough there to blow the whole village sky high. Instead of talking, do it. Not before I end Miranda. Oh my fucking god. I'm not taking any more chances. I'm going in. Roger that. Standing by. Captain, I have eyes on Miranda at the ceremony site. Keep your distance. Do not move until I give the order. I know it's too late now, but... We really should have told Ethan the plan. There wasn't time. And we didn't expect Miranda to act so soon. Even so, you should have told him. Yeah. Yeah, but you didn't, so... Whatever. This must be Miranda's lab. Ew, what's this? Huh. Oh my god. Salvatore... Okay. The K2 has caused drastic changes to external organs, transforming them into organs similar to fish like gills and a swim bladder. Another subject with irregular cell division, causing him to transform into a giant fish. The subject is unable to control this transformation. 
Too many defects. An unfit vessel for Ava. Salvatore, that's the fish one. And this one is... Oh! <gasps> Lady Dimitras! Okay, okay. Regeneration rate is incredibly fast. The subject can heal at any external wound within seconds and grow her nails into claws in mere moments. Rapid regeneration also means an increased body size. Note, due to a hereditary blood disease, the subject must ingest human flesh and blood on a regular basis to maintain regeneration properties. I suspect that if the subject's regeneration is not properly balanced, then she may mutate uncontrollably. An unvit vessel for Eva. Okay, this is Heisenberg. Has electric organs similar to the electric ray, Narki Japonica. These electric organs are connected to the subject's nervous system, can therefore pass and control electricity throughout the entire body, allowing control of magnetic fields which is used to move metal. Suspend splendid specimen but still an unfit vessel for Eva. This is Donna. Huh. Brain functions normal, although severe mental illness. Aww. Physically, she is no different from a regular human. However, she can secrete a signal producing substance which controls plants infected by the. wherever the thing is. When humans absorb the pollen from a particular flower, she can cause them to have hallucinations. However, she is mentally underdeveloped and has divided her Caillou among her dolls in order to control them from a distance. Mentally underdeveloped. Aww. An unfit vessel for Eva. Damn. This is crazy. What the hell? Huh. So basically, Leon- So they're using this to control the bioweapons. Yeah. Oh, that's her, huh? The fetus stages and all that shit. So, the reason why there was four lords is because she was trying to find a vessel for a baby. Dear Miranda, my deepest apologies for not meeting you in person. I would love nothing more than to visit your quant village once more. However, I am incredibly busy. Then again, I suppose for an immortal woman such as yourself, you no longer remember this poor, half-dead medical student in the snow. I have always cherished the revelations I came to 15 years ago when I stayed in your village. I was inspired by your research to think one could transform a human by infecting them with an organism positively visionary. I knew that with that knowledge I could achieve my own vision for the next step in human evolution. Even after two world wars and humanity on the crisp of another, my conviction never wavered. I realized, however, through the many nights of intellectual ta talks you and I shared, that your conviction differed from mine. You hope to bring back a single dead person, while well, I aim to change the world. Your experiments on the mold would not have aided me in my endeavor to achieve an exponential infection. I thought a virus would be more effective. This is why, my dear, I had to leave you. I still regret never telling you goodbye. My apologies for reminiscing. I actually have news that I thought might please you. I have found the key to evolution, the progenitor virus found in Africa. I plan to start a company with friends and colleagues dedicated to the virus research. I would call it Umbrella. Just like the symbol in the cave that we spoke about, I am one step closer to making my vision a reality. I hope you will be able to achieve your goal someday, too. You taught me so much, and for that, I will be forever in your debt. Sincerely, your lifelong student, Oswell E. Spencer. Spencer. Here. No way. The fuck? Wow. Hmm. My Eva, it's been 100 years since I lost you to the Spanish flu. I was so powerless back then. 
But now, now I can bring you back to life from the Mega Mighty. I had to test your new vessel's regenerative abilities. I took her apart and revived her in the Mega Mighty Regulator, the giant's chalice. All that is left is to merge her with the Mega Mighty. The ceremony can finally begin. After I lost you, I was so stricken with grief that I wandered into a cave to die. I still wanted to be with you again, and that's when I found it, the Megamonty, completely by accident. When I touched the black substance, my mind was overcome with knowledge. The Megamonty breaks down and absorbs the consciousness of those who have perished. I knew that if your consciousness was in there too, then there would be a way to bring you back. I just needed the right vessel. When I returned to the village, I implanted the villagers with mold from the Megamonty. That way I could control them, experiment on them. I have experimented on hundreds of people just to find you the perfect vessel. I even tried to increase the efficiency of finding a vessel by creating a parasite ca I called KU. Yet none of my experiments came to fruit fruition. There were some like Alicia who were close to being perfect but most turned into lichens. I was once approached by an organization who said they would assist me. I gave them some of the mold and your DNA. But all they created was another defect. Evelyn. Then again, not a complete failure. I learned of Rose thanks to them, and I knew she would be the perfect vessel. There was some interference, but I was able to verify her suitability. Now my research is finally complete. Ava, I have waited too long to see you again. I know, right? <sighs> Same here. Same here, broy. Like, this- this whole thing's fucking bullshit. If there's something in here, I'm gonna shoot you down, I swear to god. Show the me your fuck? hands. Um, Bryce, this is Alpha. Where is Miranda right now? Still the ceremony site. Whatever she's doing, she's staying put. Mia? God damn. If it really is you. Wow. I'm glad you saved Mia. Why are you here? Yeah. I was caught in Houston experiments. Wait, did you say Mia? Yeah, I did. The flesh. What's the situation up there? Kind of a war going on. Nothing we can't handle. Don't get distracted. Stick to the mission. I'm headed to the ceremony site. Wait. You can't leave me here. You promised, damn it. You said that you would keep us safe. Mm. We did everything that you asked. We moved over here, everything. Damn. And I didn't care. So long as we were together. So you tell me, where is my husband? He's dead. Where is my daughter? She's chopped into pieces. Gone. I couldn't save him. But I can save Rose. Now let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go. Come on. It's not safe here after all. What do you mean he's gone? He's dead. Dead as hell. Dead. I'm sorry, Mia, but we have to leave. We have to destroy this village. No! You're wrong. How? How am I wrong? I tried to keep this a secret, but... What? You don't understand how special he is. Like, special in what way? Is there a plot twist? There's a plot I KNEW there was a plot twist! Ethan, wake your ass up! I'm over here being sad because you died when all reality you were just fucking sleeping the whole time! Get your bitch ass up right now, let's go. You tell me. Hey yo, what the fuck? Oh my god. Alright, so I'm gonna keep going straight. Something I'm not familiar with. Giggity giggity. Okay. Um. How did I get here? 
Honestly, I don't even know. God, it's freezing. Wait, wait, wait. Do you have all your hands? Shit! My body! Dude, you have all your fingers! Oh, Ethan, come on. Come on, Ethan. You got this. Breathe in, breathe out. Who's fucking rude? Oh, it's, it's a little girl. From what? Resident Evil 7? How are you here? You're dead. And you're laughing dead? about it. That's mean. Uh, I mean, Miranda. She. Uh, no. I still have to save Rose. Rose? <laughs> it wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What do you mean? What are you saying? I can still. Uh... Wait a minute. Am I a zombie? Is that why I'm able to put my hand back in its place? See? Miranda didn't kill you. Oh lord. You mean you didn't think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt. I thought it was just, you know, continuity. Remember. Not adding up. Ooh, shit. <gasps> Three years ago. Baker house. My wifey. Damn. You were murdered by Jack. You died there three years ago. Damn. That's that's impossible. No way. <laughs> you shouldn't even be able to walk around. Am I a zombie? <laughs> You shouldn't be walking. Screw you! <laughs> what, what am I? A zombie, bro. You're a zombie. I... I... I, I did all that. <laughs> Rose... Mia... I... Come on, Ethan. Get up, Ethan. Whoa, what the fuck? Now do you get it? <laughs> Your whole body is nothing but mold. <laughs> you can't ever see your family again. Family? Family. Damn. No. Rose. I have to save my daughter. You're already dead. <laughs> dead. Yo, this girl's so mean. Like, I get it. I die, but you don't have to make fun of me for it. Like, fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Poor Ethan. I will. Save Rose! That's right, Ethan! Do it! Thank you for watching this episode. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next week.